Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing this very dramatic fall smoky eye. I think it's perfect for a night out. And you know what? Thanksgiving is coming up. So for those of you girls that love looking glamorous and really just want to amp it up with a makeup for that day, I think this look is perfect. It just screams fall. I love it. So if you do want to see how I get this look, then just keep on watching. I've already primed my eyes with my Penelope Paint Pot by MAC, then I'm taking my NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in the color Black Bean, and I'm just going to be applying that on my eyelids. Then you want to make sure you blend it out, I'm just going to be blending it out with my fingers. I'm going to take my favorite color which is Cocoa Bear by Makeup Geek and I'm going to be applying this with a fluffy brush on the crease. My eyeshadow was looking a little bit harsh so I went in with a lighter shade which is called Frappe. This is also from Makeup Geek and I just pretty much blended it out just to smoothen it out. This next shadow is the star of the show. This is Burlesque and this is by Makeup Geek. I'm going to be applying this on the eyelid and I'm going to blend it up a little bit towards the crease. And you guys this color is so pretty. This is the definition of fall. taking Bitten which is also by Makeup Geek and this is also a really nice burgundy except this is matte so I'm going to be applying that on the crease. I'm going to be taking Mocha which is also by Makeup Geek. It's a perfect dark brown. I'm applying this because one my eyes look super sick with all that burgundy going on so I applied the brown just to really balance it out and two I love how the brown really deepens up that crease and really warms it up. Right now I'm just taking a fluffy brush and really blending everything out because I cannot stand those harsh lines. I'm taking this NYX setting spray and I'm just spraying my brush with it and I'm going to be applying again that beautiful burgundy shade which is called Burlesque and by doing this it just makes it look a lot more metallic and you'll see a difference right now as you can tell I mean it is such a huge difference so make sure you wet it if you don't have setting spray you can always just use like water or eye drops and then I'm taking the color shroom by MAC and just highlighting the brow bone I'm taking my NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Black Bean and just lining my upper lash line. I'm going to be taking Corrupt by Makeup Geek and I'm just applying this with a pencil brush and just really smoking that out. I'm going to move in with a more precise brush and really pack on that black shadow. The step I'm about to show you is optional. I'm taking Corrupt and Mocha. I'm making this look a little bit more dramatic because in person my eyes look very smoked out but on camera it just wasn't picking up all the darkness. So in order for you guys to see how it really looked, I had to darken it up. I'm taking Sheena Sujin eyelashes. I really hope I'm saying her name right. And these are in the name Ginger Rogers. She was very generous to send me a bunch of her lashes. She just launched them November 1st. I'll have the link down below where you can get these. I did post on Instagram all the lashes she got me and I also tagged her so go follow her. So I did already do my foundation. I'll have my foundation routine linked down below. I'm going to be bronzing my face with my Too Faced or not Too Faced, oh my god, my, what is this, the Hula Bronzer by Benefit. I'm applying this underneath my cheekbones, my forehead, and I'm also going to contour my nose a little bit. I'm taking this blush from La Femme in the color Mocha and just applying it on the cheekbones. I felt like being matte today, so I did skip the highlighter. I'm taking this lip liner by NYX in the color Natural and just filling my entire lips with it. And sorry, I didn't get a full clip of this. Then I'm going to be taking my Gerard Cosmetics lip gloss in the color Buttercup and just applying that right above. I am going to be applying a little bit more in the center just to make my lips a little bit more fuller. 
At this moment, I completely forgot to smoke out my under eyes, so I'm going to move on to that. I'm just taking this L'Oreal uh, pencil liner and lining my waterline, and then I'm going to be bringing it down below the lower lash line, and then I'm going to take my pencil brush and grab the Corrupt, which is a black shadow, and really smoke it out. I really liked how black this pencil was, so I decided I would line my eyes again. And by the way, this is L'Oreal Color Rich. If any of you guys want to try it out, it is super, super black. And then I'm going to go in again with Corrupt and set that. So that is the finished look. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys later.